Names matter! Black Names matter! Minneapolis native Larry Fitzgerald, his first coach in his career. Dennis Green, African American. 113 wins for Dennis Green during his NFL career. 113 wins and 94 losses. He coached the Minnesota Vikings. Larry Fitzgerald is from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Dennis Green's from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. We can see Kamala Harris become the first female president. Joe Biden from Pennsylvania. So the whole Minneapolis native with Kamala Harris being from the Bay Area connects to the fact that the Cardinals were the first first team to hire a female coach. This video is going to be about the prior coach of the Cardinals who was Steve Wilkes. He had a 3 and 13 record with the Cardinals. He was fired before being replaced by Cliff Kingsbury who's going to take the Cardinals to the very top of the cliff. This is the meaning of Cliff Kingsbury. Steve Wilkes, the reason why he's coaching the Cardinals He's from Charlotte, Carolina, where the Carolina Panthers play at. The reason why he was the prior coach of Arizona is because the Black Panther Party was where Black Lives Matter originated from. It didn't start in Minneapolis, Minnesota. It started where the original Black Panther Party was founded, and he came to the Cardinals over from the Carolina Panthers. Steve Wilkes, after being fired, the Cardinals are going to end a 74-year championship title. It is Wilkes that has Demacia of 74. It is Larry that has Demacia of 74. He would end up beating Patrick Mahomes in the Super Bowl. Carolina was where Steve Wilkes was at. The former Panther defensive coordinator was fired. He was replaced by Cliff Kingsbury. The last coach of the Cardinals was black. The Cardinals hired a black a general manager. I... Uh, his name was Rod Graves. He may have been the first black general manager. I'd have to go check that on Google right now. Let's tie this into Rod Graves and the Jesuit values of diversity of the Jesuit Bidwell owners of the Cardinals. Rod Graves was the black general manager of the Arizona Cardinals. He took the Cardinals to the Super Bowl right before Obama got elected. Rod Graves from Houston, Texas, where George Floyd was murdered at. Getting DeAndre Hopkins from Houston. You see that with Rod Graves. He's 62 years of age. It's Cardinal that has Demacia of 62 and 13. What about Floyd? Floyd has Demacia of 62. You get that? You get that? So Rod Graves, Larry Fitzgerald's first general manager, was black. Keep that in mind, too. But going back to Steve Wilkes, 73 years, the Cardinals are not going to win the championship until they win in the 74th season. Black Panther Party, Carolina Panthers, this is how Steve Wilkes, the former Cardinals coach, ties into the Black Lives Matter theme of the black quarterback in the Minneapolis native Winning the Super Bowl. Larry Fitzgerald had two black coaches in his career. Steve Wilkes and Dennis Green, the Minneapolis native, no longer with us, passed away in 2016. But Steve Wilkes, former coach being black, this is part of the Black Lives Matter ritual. I already talked about, you know, Michael Floyd being a teammate of Larry Fitzgerald. And Rod Graves, first general manager of Larry Fitzgerald, was also black. So tying in Black Lives Matter with the Arizona Cardinals winning the Super Bowl with Kyler Murray, Minneapolis native Larry Fitzgerald, Houston native DeAndre Hopkins.